During our Farm Basics time today, we're going to talk about variable rate fertilizer and how farmers use that in their operations. One of the great things about technology in agriculture is it has allowed us to see how variable our fields are. Now you may have the same soil type across the field. It's been handled exactly the same over the years. But when the yield monitor shows you've got 200 bushel corn in parts of the field and 100 bushel corn in other parts of the field, putting out the same amount of nutrition just doesn't make sense. Well, quite frankly, I don't care as much about what the soil type is, but I do care about exactly what Darren was talking about there. What ultimately is the yield potential? And the whole thing is, if you hear in the media about farmers misusing fertilizer, I just always think that's a bunch of nonsense. When was the last time you ran into a farmer who wanted to waste money? No way! Farmers are the most conservative people there are, I think. So every farmer is trying to figure out how can I spend as little as possible on fertility yet maximize my yields. So now what many farmers are doing is they are soil testing in all different areas in the field to figure out how much do they need in each spot in that field for fertilizer. And then when they apply that, as they go through the field, the machine has what we would call a script or basically a prescription. So it will vary the rates of fertilizer that's applied as you cross the field. Well, it all starts with that good soil testing program. And this is something, whether you've got a farm or you've got a garden or a yard, whatever, you can do this soil testing wherever you're at and feed whatever you're trying to grow the same way that farmers are doing. So you want to take a six inch soil core and you'll pull about a quart's worth of soil from a relatively small area. And then if you've got a great big field, you'll want to do that every so often, like many farmers will do every one acre, which is about the size of a football field as they head across their farm, pull those soil samples and look at all the nutrients out there that your crop will need to grow. So not just nitrogen, phosphorus, and potassium, but also the secondary and micronutrients as well. Someday my dream is we could just cross the field with a machine that would sense what we have for nutrients in the soil already and we apply based on that. But we don't have that kind of technology today. What we do have is soil testing. And so we do various soil tests throughout the field to figure out where exactly do we need to put our fertilizer and then we apply it at differing rates and we call that variable rate fertilizer. Well, one other thing that may vary as you travel across fields is weed pressure. If you've got our Weed of the Week, we'll show you how to get it under control later in the show.